Hi friends, welcome back again. Today I am just gonna explain you how to create workflow workflow rules. Here we have four types that is called task, email, field update, and outboxing. Okay. Before that, we will discuss about the things like in this manner. First, we will create control C. This is, first, I will explain the how to create field update and then task and then email alert email. First, let us see what is exactly the workflow means. Don't worry, I will provide these notes in my video. Here see, we have a navigation, just see here, create and then workflow approvals and we have a workflow rules, click on workflow rules, we will see, why we need a workflow rules in salesforce.com exactly, many of the tasks you normally assign, the emails you regularly send and other second updates. At the part of your organization standard process, instead of doing this work manually, have Salesforce do it automatically by configuring workflow. That means instead of doing manually, we can make automatic process. Nothing but a task, email alerts, field updates, outboxing message. Let's see the first thing called field update. Now we will discuss about the field update. What is exactly field update? How to create a workflow? This is how create workflow approvals and workflow rules. Just log into your credentials. Sorry. Just click here and then create. Create and workflow approvals. There you will find workflow rules. Here, this is nothing. Just click on continue blindly. Here you will get a new work. We don't have any workflow, so I'm just gonna explain and create a new workflow called an object called account object. Click next. And this is my first workflow. Just here we have three options: create, create and every time, create and any time to subsequently meet. To. Create in the sense whenever the records creates this workflow will execute recreate and every time it's edited means once account created or if any modification has takes place on the already created account it will execute create and any time in the third option it is different from this actually it will execute on create time on the first time of update in the first time of update no other time okay just click on create create or meet just i'm selecting field account name is my mandatory field and not equal to null click save and next you will find workflow. I am just asking here as a new field update. Click on name. My first update. Unique name. And just click. Which field I have to replace? I am just selecting as a description here. Next. Okay. Nothing. Use a formula value. Here we have to provide. I am providing. Field is updated. My field is updated. Save. Nothing. Okay, sorry. I have to pass double quotes here. Save. See, it's saved, right? What you will do here? Just click again on workflows. Continue. Here you will see activate. Just click on activate in workflows. Now what you will do, I will, I'm just gonna create a accounts. See, I have no, I will create a new account. Account name is called Deepak. See, I'm, I'm not going, my description is, I'm very happy. I'm very happy, just click save. See here, my field is updated. What I, I am very happy, I just given a description, but it's my feeling. What I will do, I will edit now. I 
I felt bad about it. Click save. See what happened now. Now it is saved, right? So once created, at the time of created, only it will exit. What I will do here, I'm just gonna edit again. Edit. What I will do, I will select the second option, save. What I will do, I will create a new record again. New record with the name of Wasabi. What I will do here, I am glad to hear. Save. See what happened. My field is updated. If I edit it, in the previous case, if I edit it, my second, the object is saved. That means my second description is saved when I am updating. When I am updating, second value have to save. This is happened in my record. If I select record, now we are selecting record, create and edit. Now it see it won't change. Again, it will. My field is updated. This is a, what is the difference? We will understand. Even if you updated also, the description field is same. What I will do here? Okay, we will see one thing. What I will do here? to understand more clearly sorry okay l l just leave that what I will do again I will edit again in the my workflow I am just gonna choose create and anytime in the created not equal to null same query what I will do account new N name is Lakshmi Deepak See, Lakshmi, Deepak, save, my field is updated, again I am editing, see, what I will do here, instead of Lakshmi Deepak, I will say Lakshmi Deepak 1, not thing, see, again the field is up, see, even the first time is changed, right? This is how the field record will go some. That means if we select create, every time whenever you are going to create a new record, at the time the rule will be workflow will execute. Create and every time it's edited. Whenever the record is created and whenever the all rec existing record edited, it will execute. Create and any time it's edited means at this particular time when only the subsequent time it will execute. And what I will do here. I am just going to choose. Now I am going, what I will do? I just save. I am just saving here. Accounts. What I will do here now? Here. Here you will see right? My first field. Just click on workflow actions. Now we will select the add workflow uh, instead of I am just editing the field update to be cancel. Okay, sorry, we can't be able to do that. Just remove that. No, you don't want that. I don't want that. I just removing for a clear understanding. I am just going to select your new task. Assign to where I have to assign. I am just selecting the is my user subject PASK new nickname due date regular trigger press zero that means at the same time no need to select that one status is not started okay priority it's not mandatory as your wish save whenever the talk new record creates whenever new records create consider Abdul records created the task will be generated task for the C it is priority normal assigned to Inukurti Lokumar and the state is not started this is how the task will execute what I will do here I will remove this one for next before going with the email alert now first we have to create email template just go communication templates and click 
click on email templates and click new template it must be an un unified public click text select text and go with the next where I will choose account fields and then account name this is my, just copy this one just provide your name my template same but no need just go with hi dear now the account name is going to generate to a template just click save what I will do here it's completed mm, ok back to list ok communication and templates email templates he is not active right just for that sake we have to activate the thing just we have to activate save whenever the task generated it will send mail see what I will do here again I will create a new record here new Lakshmi Deepak 12 save I'm just showing you the mail now takes time whenever you create a mail task it will send email to your account okay what I will do here, oh, no no sorry we have to configure this email what I will do here, click on new new email alert mm, and then description my mail and I can select the template select the template my template click use a right so what I will do here, email field I will add email field what is owner account on ok user select user just select Lakshmi Deepak I have this mail ID with me as your choice click save you see I didn't have any mails from a Salesforce account. Now, if I create new account, see it is active. Okay. What I will do? I will create a record now. Accounts. New. One year row. This is saving. One year row is my name. Okay. What I will do here? I will just open my mail. See here. In Kutila Kumar, hi. We'll get, we have to get hi Vanira, dear Vanira. This is how whenever the new task is created, field update will take place. So far, what we discuss, we discuss about how to field update, task, email, and outbox messaging is the confidential information transfer between the two organization accounts. So it is not possible in a developer version. We'll see in real time some other times. Thank you.
Before that, I'll just explain you how to use the notes which I provided in my documents. Okay, just go with the browser. Just to open your browser. Okay, it takes time. Don't worry. See here, there is a contract. Click sign out. He, this is the URL to my notes. That means what I will record video, I will be kept in a I just kept those things in my website just see here just navigate to that URL HTTP sorry something happened okay. HTTP forward slash one dr dot ms slash one capital I x is it capital Z capital Z B one just hit enter you will navigate to your page you'll navigate to a page see here so what you'll do here first you have to select class notes oh, sorry first help data select help data first it is mandatory and the passwords I have to where you will be automatically sent to your account when you subscribe my channel it is the password here it password is sent to your mail ID once you can't once you subscribe my channel. See and then click class notes. Here it will ask password again. You will navigate and just click on a page basic concepts in salesforce.com. And see, this is the navigation direct for navigation for a better understanding. We just created some tabs here. Navigate till to create apps, objects, and workflows and workflows rules. Click on workflows rules. Those buttons are see, we have full description. Once you understand this everyone everything, click this button, it will show you full screen. Once you clear up everything, here you have workflow rules for more info. Click on workflow rules. See here, workflows is used for automation and click how to create workflow rules. Select the object for workflow rule. See, we have a bunch of information. Okay, if you completed the process, so, this is how you can navigate my notes. It's easy. See, I just given a full description. Click here to get more. Once you click here, you will get a password automatically, or you can contact through my Facebook ID or through my email 